and talk to some more people, I'm sure. Some more people hanging about in here. I need to go to my room and return Warren's flash drive. Yes. The Prescott Dormitory donated by Song Prescott and uh, Prescott Foundation 1998. The Prescott Dormitory? Good lord, Nathan's family owns my dorm? <sighs> okay. Hello there, Alyssa. Oh. Hi, Max. Hello. So, what are you reading? What are you reading? Love today or die forever. Don't even say anything. It's a bestseller. What to say? Good point. Now if you'll excuse me. Fine. Fine. I yeah. doubt I could be talking to these guys. Well, I can so to speak talk. No, bro. You can't take a picture. You gotta wait till Friday's game. Fine. And there's the janitor that we called weird. Victoria. Oh look, it's Max Caulfield, the selfie hoe of Blackwell. Hmm. What a lame gimmick. Even Mark, Mr. Jefferson, falls for your wave hipster bullshit. The Daguerrean processor. Awesome. You could barely even say that. I guess you got your meds filled. <laughs> oh, that's a nice person. Since you know all the answers, I guess you have to find another way into the dorm. We ain't moving. Right. Oh, wait. Hold that pose. Ugh. So original. Don't worry, Max. I'll put a vintage filter on it right before I post it all over social medias. Now, why don't you go fuck your selfie? Oh, yes, <sighs> Victoria. I'll get your bony ass out of my way. If we None would have made pass. some Capiche? other choices sure. that at least would have, uh, for example, maybe affected them not being there, probably not, but maybe. Can I chat to you, Samuel? There goes Samuel Da Vinci to paint the window. Aw. Sprinkles. I could crank the sprinkler up and give Victoria and her <laughs> clones incentive to beat it. I was thinking originally that I could go and uh, actually climb up there too and go to that way, but maybe that's what I need to do to crank the spring girls. Nice, Can't bro. talk to you. That's weird. A totem like there. Maybe we will go and see about it. Hmm. There is that sort of a situation there too. Wonder what I should be doing with that. I guess we'll see. Huh. Interesting. Okay, now hmm. where exactly is the sprinkler valve? No. That's a good question too. Or we could try to somehow use that considering it really specifically wanted to point into this. Okay. I need to figure this out. Hold right mouse button to rewind. We'll do that. Let's just rewind a little bit quicker. So what exactly happens there when he puts it there like that? Why is that important? Hmm. Came even a little bit more into here than was needing to or should have. Hmm. Well, this door is open in here. So we can very well go into here if we wish. This main sprinkler valve looks easy enough to use. I should probably use it at the same time as he Sweet. would step into there, maybe? Maybe? Not Wait. sure. It could be. But of course, I'm not sure. Anyways, for the moment. 
This main sprinkler valve looks easy enough to use. I think he already put it and now I can't use it. Okay. Let's just rewind a little bit again. Let's just make sure there's nothing else here important. Was it again too slow? Yeah. Just a little bit teeny tiny bit too slow. Um, okay. This main sprinkler valve looks easy enough to use. That's one more then, I guess. What the hell? Are you kidding? Look at this! Chill, Victoria. It's just water. Yeah, water on my cashmere. Do you know how much this fucking outfit costs? You look great. I can't even chill <laughs> on the steps. Yeah, you're not supposed to be just chilling on the steps. And then this happens. And what would I need to do about it? Keep walking, I can't, hippie. can't go past here. Even though I should be able to basically go from there. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to exactly do. Hmm. Okay, now it's hasn't even happened yet. Not sure if I should be doing it again or not. I guess I'll try to do it again. Then he is almost there, but nice. yeah, I have no idea exactly what I'm supposed to do with that. Just hmm. Rachel owes me money. They are bitch. Right. Which isn't even in here. I was thinking that... <sighs> what am I supposed to do with that then? It's an excellent question to me. I guess I'll have to try to ponder yeah. this a bit more. There's not a lot of things that I can interact with after all. Hmm. This doesn't even say that I would have been able to change anything yet, specifically. It's pretty much that I have to wait until this. Ooh. Tamper. So that it would maybe fall. Alrighty. Okay, let's see if this works. And then let's also use sprinkles so that uh, they go away from there. Skip it, skip. So now he is climbing there. He may be making that fall. Who knows exactly how this is gonna go. Yeah. No way! No fucking okay, way! <laughs> oh, Samuel is sorry. Wet, wet paint is not good for hair, no? Sorry. Get the hell away from me, weirdo. Yay. Hold on, hold on. We'll get some towels. We'll be right back. So move your ass before I dry. It worked. Don't mess with Max, bitches. Yay. I was thinking that maybe I could be tampering with it, but of course I wasn't quite sure. Speak. Uh, hey, Victoria. What do you want, Max? Comfort. We don't have to be like her. I am sorry. That's an awesome cashmere coat. It was. But there will be another. Yes, I'm sure there well, will be. You always seem to know how to pick the right outfits. I do have some talent. Mr. Jefferson told me. I've seen your pictures. You have a great eye. Richard Avedon-esque. He's one of my heroes. Thanks, Max. You're welcome. I hope those sluts get me a towel before they hang a sign on me. No. I'm sure they will. You deserve a better shot. Sorry about blocking you and, and the go fuck your selfie. No worries. That was mean, but pretty funny. <laughs> Just one of those days, you know? I know exactly what you mean, Victoria. I'll see you later. Okay. Au revoir. Au revoir. Thank you. We don't have to be acting like that ourselves. Victoria probably played me. I should have played her. 
No. Better get to my room before I find Warren. Left mouse button to enter. But yeah, I'm like, no matter what she does, well, how she wants to be acting, we can act the way we are. We don't have to be going in and doing the same sort of thing as someone else. Room 217? No way in hell am I ever going in here. Victoria is going right to be pissed Trump? we took so long. Sorry. Taylor is a slave. Is this a Vortex Club or a Victoria Club initiation? Truly pathetic. Hmm. No boys allowed. As if. <laughs> yeah, there's probably are some boys. I'd love to make a photo collage of every person who've posted these. Don't be afraid. Be ready. Young guns trading. Every under 21. Even under 21, you can still learn how to operate firearms. From AK to Swatovska. Young Guns uses uh, fun, safe, perfect plastic replica. Stop by out bunker for a test demo. <sighs> Young guys and girls. Yeah. Man, people here are merciless. Safe, not sorry. No matter how much you like each other, one slip up and can change your life. You have a choice. There's nothing wrong with waiting. See Gates video for proof. Can you hear me? Yes, we all can. Please respect your uh, neighbors. Be quiet after 10 p.m. Thank you for listening. Right. Juliet. Juliet, extreme reporter. <laughs> Missing person posters again. Toilet paper. Yeah, Looks they're like bringing. Looks like nobody won this TP war. There's nothing left but ghosts. Yeah, there's another At least firearm. that's an alarm from this century. Not like the other. So what's in these places? Don't be they a zombie. Live. Yes, they live. Social media has a time and place. Don't let life lash you by. Okay, this is just mean and stupid. Real pang for Jesus. Ha 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 ha. Yeah, yeah. Let's just clean that up. Let's do something nice there. Be sign. We'll see what kind of consequences it will have. This is like the public DNA of our dorm. Don't let depression keep you down. Everybody gets sad and lonely. And if you need someone to talk to, please call us anytime, day or night, and we will listen because we care. 24 hour live hotline. And then help some of these are easier to read if you go into this help it's been almost a month of stats and i still don't understand is this matter of philosophy with crabs help i will pay if you get me an a and then the lost phone hmm. oh yeah there was something more too wasn't there this is like the public dna of our dorm meat is still murder join the blackwell weekend club Veggie potluck at every evening. Fine enough. And girls' night out. Halloweeny. Dream along. A nightmare before Christmas. October. Dormitory lawns. Bye monthly. Bye friendly. Good. What's this oh, then? Victoria, give me a fucking break. Be the James you wish to see. County. <laughs> so this is our dormitory. Or not poster but what's this poster really trying to tell me uh this is your planet and when it comes to protecting that one you're the boss why is there this picture then with the earth it's up to you well someone else has put it there i guess it's up to you to make a chain choice so come raise your voice save the earth yeah good question warren should be uh, all over bye. brooke they're perfect for each other hmm Sort of, yes, yeah, seems like it. The forks. Eating the vegetables. Max's room. Oh yeah, that's where I needed to go. How sad. I didn't write anything. I have nothing to say. Well, let's try to draw something. Max. Is that the... <laughs> Obvious, but true. Aww. 
I guess I'll have a look quickly into here before we go actually to the room there though. Just to be on the sure side that I've looked to everything that I want. Alert on the campus. Could be fun. Glad I'm not the only lonely nerd around here. Kick girl book club. Hmm. No boy wizards or sad vampire fiction allowed. No boys appeared. Looking for our like-minded souls to read and discuss Archer's Ursula, La Queen, Rapid Hop, Terry Prook, Simmer Bradley, and the usual flying truck and shit. And the bike is for sale, and I forgot to look more. Could be thanks for the warning. <laughs> Coming soon, the Fordux Club. Sours. Not exactly. Then something that we want to go into. There's also a wet floor. Okay, enter. Our room. Little loaded teddy bear. Home sweet home. My favorite cocoon. Mm. Warren even left me a little message with his flash drive. He's such a goofball. <laughs> so what does it say? To Max of whom it may concern, the cinematic contents of this flash drive are of graphic, life-altering, controversial nature. This collection has been downloaded with the greatest care and for the most discriminating viewer, I congratulate and seek you on your taste and equally await you in depth review of Cannibal Holocaust and Ultra Phoenix. Peace, Warren G. Radio. Look. Hard to believe I'm 18. Do I look any older? Just more stressed. Mom is also sending us a new text. Let's take a photo, just for the fun of it. There is quite a lot on the photo wall, though. I didn't mean to do that. Turn off. What does this do? I'm accidentally pressing into that sometimes the when Max I'm not Caulfield meaning to. Auto Memorial wall. Hmm. And a daddy bear. Ahoy, Captain. At least I know you've got my back. Mm. When I swallowed your eye and my parents Aww. rushed me to the ER, I knew we were bonded forever. Were you saying something more about it? No. Okay, text. SMS from mom. Hi, honey. Your principal sent me an email saying that he's concerned about your attitude and behavior, that you are not fitting in well and hiding in your dorm. I know it's hard to be away from home, even if you are all grown up now, but you are there to change the world with your camera. Please call me as soon as that, as soon to shout to you. Miss you. Yeah. Hi. That's of course for the reason that <laughs> we we didn't tell. Lie down. I shouldn't really lie down for a long time when we're just trying to be coming and picking up the last drive. It's so nice to just relax. This day has been so damn bizarre and it feels like it has gone on forever. Mm. Maybe I'll just wake up now and find out I was dreaming all of this. I guess. Or like Poe said. Probably not. A dream within a dream. Dream within a dream. Let's just get up though. We gotta be going. And then this cushion. So cheesy, but <laughs> it makes me smile thinking of the day Mom and I sewed that together. Oh, well, it's nice that you did it together. Cartier Bresson, Doineau, Hamilton, the greatest. Hmm. I should hit and the thrift store and pick up some dollar vinyl. Is that too hipster? Maybe. I don't care. Music inspires me in my photography. That's not too bad then. Whatever <sighs> inspires you. Max and Chloe. Best friends forever. Who even says that anymore? <laughs> I'm going to have to call Chloe eventually and find out what she'll say. The longer I wait, the worse it'll be. Idiot. Yeah, you should really be meeting with her then. You got that picture even. So yeah, you definitely should. That's the only tourist picture I let them take of me at the Space Needle. <laughs> Why? That was a good hockey game and a great fight. Man, Kristen and Fernando were so drunk hanging on the Fremont Troll. Hmm. I know a few pictures. Here's my go-to source for instant photo inspiration. Okay. Philip Lorca de Corsha, my man. I don't think I could take my camera to those places. Look at that shot. Hmm. I love Julia Cameron's Victorian vibe. Talk about analog cameras. Ah, oh, mm. Dolly, what a fantastic eye. He could truly freeze time. 
Hmm. And then Luke. There's my poor laptop begging me to check in. Oh, I guess we shall quickly. Daniel has so much talent. I hope nobody hates on it just because it's me. Hopefully not. <laughs> Quick uh, skits of my new muse. Hopefully not. Hopefully it's all fine and dandy. I am so addicted to this site. Look at these vintage beauties. They may be something bad though. Camera porn. <laughs> Warren makes me laugh. It's nice to feel like I already made a real friend here. Warren Graham. Um, Max, thanks for your email and copy of Jefferson's class notes. Now I shall never stop sending you messages of gratitude. I shall have a writer excellent collection of TV, cult, classic, and fucked up films on a pad flans dry if you ever want to check them out. Thanks again for the help. I'm signed as more than an artist. Now, can you quickly explain to me how a camera works? <laughs> uh, busy in you, Warren G. Yes. Sticky note. Looks like Dana left me a little post-it note. Hey girl, I poured your tribe so I can watch some flicks while I study. If you need it back, just track me down in my room. Great. Now I have to go get the flash drive from Dana's room. Yeah, apparently so. One day I'll organize my film collection. One day I'll get an actual HDTV. Someday, someday. Luke, I haven't plant. forgotten you, little Lisa. Yet. Well, I guess we should water it then, if we haven't you forgotten are it. I'm the worst baby mama. Drink up. Good. Where do we see here? This action will also have consequences. Oh, there's also a photo. I haven't forgotten you, little Lisa. In there, sort of. Yet. Luke. If I'm not looking through a viewfinder, I'm looking through a window. Always looking. Always looking. Always observing. Instant film. Instant film is so damn hard to find and expensive now. But mm. I can't help it. I'm analog, not digital. Mm. I'm glad Kate let me borrow her copy of The October Country. I should have every Bradbury book for myself. I would love to have a really nice analog to go uh, camera as well as sus. I'll miss going to the games with my dad. Go Thunderbirds. And then there's a guitar. It's such a pretty guitar. I need to play it more. Then you should. Let's play for just a moment. We have we're wasting so much time. He was asking us to actually hurry in this thing, and we're just and just doing everything else. Just just everything else. Hmm. Can play nicely now. A little bit of music. For the way. Just watching the environment, our place, our very own little dorm room. Okay, then just the uh, cookies. I love that mom sent me a fat box of chocolate coconut bites for my birthday. <laughs> and slipped in a $200 gift certificate. That's nice. She sure knows how to make a sad birthday happy. Hmm. It's not exactly pretty in pink, but no shits are given. I like my wardrobe. That's nice. Would Man Ray call them selfie portraits? I don't know. And then a drawer. Hard to believe I'm 18 now. I'm lucky my parents enabled my photo habit into adulthood. Hmm. Happy birthday, Maxine. We'll never forget the day you were born and your first smile. It was love at first sight. It's your special day. We miss you, but we're so proud that you're following your dreams. We love you, your mother and father. It's nice. It's good that they are encouraging. Oh, we need to go... Uh, whose room was it? Tune in for more next time in Life is Strange.